witchcraft alert someone is going down because of you this can't happen again they messed with the wrong person shalom the lord bless you welcome to purpose and marital bliss with pastor honoring i have a word to share with someone and this word is coming to us from revelations chapter 12 I'll take from verse 1 to verse 6. The Bible says, A great sign appeared in heaven, a woman clothed with the sun, with the moon under her feet, and a crown of twelve stars on her head. She was pregnant and cried out in pain as she was about to give birth. Then another sign appeared in heaven, an enormous, an enormous red dragon with seven heads and ten horns and seven crowns on his head. His tail swept a third of the stars out of the sky and flung them to the earth. The dragon stood in front of the woman who was about to give birth so, it, so that it might devour her child the moment he was born. She gave birth to a son, a male child, who will rule all the nations with an iron scepter. And her child was snatched up to God and to his throne. The woman fled into the wilderness, the place prepared for her by God, where she might be taken care of for 1,000 years. 260 days. Hallelujah. Verse 7. Let's just get verse 7. It says, Then war broke out in heaven. Michael and his angels fought against the dragon. And God sent me here and said, They are going down because of you. They messed with the wrong person. And this word is coming to someone. At the, you've, you've had this negative pattern. Almost success syndrome. Where you, you work hard and you work hard and you work hard. When it is almost the time for you to get to your breakthrough. That's when the enemy attacks you. That's when the enemy cripples all your efforts. This woman was pregnant and she was already in labor. And I'm wondering where was this dragon when she just conceived? Where was the dragon in the first trimester? In the second trimester? In the third trimester? How could the dragon allow her to go through the process if you have ever given birth? then you know the discomfort and the stress that comes with pregnancy but she had to go through all the process i'm talking to someone that you 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 you, you spend your life building you lay the foundation you build and build and build when you're at the verge of reaping the results the reward for your hard labor the enemy attacks god says this time is not so god says this time is not going to happen they are going down because they mess with the wrong person they are going Going down because they mess with the wrong person. After all your hard work, when you are at the verge of handling your evidence in your hand, the evidence, the child is the evidence that you've been indeed pregnant. Your baby is the evidence, and then the dragon comes, the devil shows up and is waiting for you to give birth so that he can devour the child. But God says, Not so. God says, This time the battle is of the Lord. This time the battle is not of Allah. The battle is not of you, it's of the Lord. In past times, you are someone. Uh, the Holy Spirit just told me there is someone you are, you are, you've been pregnant with prophecy. You've been pregnant with prophecy. God gave you a promise. God gave you a prophecy. And every time you, were, you have been at the verge, you feel like you're almost dead. The devil knocks you down. Every time you feel like this is it, the devil knocks you out. Every time you feel like you are almost dead, this is what God talked about. Something happens and you go right back to square one. God says, not this time around. Not this time around. Not this time around. 
Kabaraso Brasha Kaliana Karua, La Riza Kabarusha Kaliana Raso Brahanda, Lise Kabarusha. The first thing that happened was that the child was taken by God. God took the child to a safe place. God is protecting that miracle. God is protecting your harvest. God is protecting your miracle. The enemy will not see it this time around in the name of Jesus. The devil will not tamper with it this time around in the name of Jesus. Someone you date and date and you build a good relationship when it is at the verge of marriage. Something knocks it out. Something happens and you come back to being single. Or you come back to begging and just trying to fix things. God says not this year. Not this time. It has happened long enough. Not anymore. Every Whatever you sweated to build. God says this year. This year. This year. You will enjoy the fruit of your labor. You've carried that vision, that pregnancy, that word. You've incubated it. Ah, your color is so under. Nothing will tamper with that pregnancy. Nothing will tamper with that vision. Nothing will tamper in the name of Jesus. Leziana baraso brashaka. Leana barushaka liara suhanda baruza. The next thing is that God took the woman to a place that she that has been prepared for her. God is protecting you. I give God permission in the name of Jesus to take charge over you, over your miracle, over your next level, over your breakthrough, over your marriage. God will protect you and that miracle in the name of Jesus. And then the third thing that God does is that Michael is dispatched. In the mighty name of Jesus, we deploy Michael to fight whatsoever power that has fought you. Michael took over the battle. Michael and his angels fought the dragon. Ah, Lizzie, Kabaru, Shakaliana, Barasi, Handa, Larua, Shakaliana. Every power that wants to stand on your way. In the mighty name of Jesus, we deploy Michael and his angels to fight for you. We deploy Michael and his angels to fight for you. Lizzie, Kabarasi, Handa, Barusha, Laziana, Barasi, Anna, Barusha. This time around, that breakthrough will happen. This time around, that prophecy will be fulfilled. This time around, you are and you are becoming a millionaire. This time around, that marriage will hold. In the name of Jesus, we deploy Michael and his angels. This time around, your health will be fulfilled, will be restored. This time around, that surgery will be a success. This time around, there will be no pro no 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 complications, no attack on your health. This time around, we deploy Michael and his angels. Kaziana Kabarasiana to stop the nonsense of the devil. It will not happen again in the name of Jesus. The Bible tells us in John chapter 12, verses 9 to 11. After, after Lazarus has been resurrected, the Bible says people came to not just see Jesus, but they wanted to see Lazarus too. Because Lazarus had become the, 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 the evidence of the resurrection power. And, and the Bible says that the Pharisees and the authorities, they started plotting not just to kill Jesus, but also to kill Lazarus. They, they, they were plotting to kill the evidence that Jesus had of the resurrection power. They were not just after Jesus. They were after the evidence. And God is telling me, someone, the devil has been after your evidence. After the promise of God over your life. There have been an attack. Ah, an attack on the prophecy of God over your life. Then that has been the reason of the attack. Ah, because God gave a word. The enemy, I don't know about you, but I'm praying for myself too. The enemy came at me with a vengeance because of a prophecy that I receive in the mighty name of jesus i deploy michael every attack that you have 
experience by reason of prophecy. Aliana kabarua shakali zakabayana kabarua lize kabaru shakaliana. That prophecy is manifesting in your life, and Michael is taking charge of those who have fought your prophecy in the name of Jesus. Ali zikabarasiana. I know what I'm talking about. I know what I'm talking about. I know what it means to receive a prophecy. Laziana kabarusha. Lize kabarasiana barusha kali yaraso kabaruza brashaka. Iyana kala ruasa kaliana. Because prophecy was given to you and attack came at you. The devil came at you with a vengeance. And someone is just dawning on you because you didn't know. That's why you were fought. You were fought because of a prophecy. The reason why your, your finances went under attack was because of prophecy. But in the mighty name of Jesus, I deploy angel, angel Michael and his angels. Let them fight whoever has said your prophecy will not manifest. Ah, Liana Kabarasiana, you don't understand what I'm talking about. La Zika Barusha Kaliana Rasiana. From the time the prophecy of the call of God over my life and of my, my assignment was, was, was uttered, my health came under attack. But this is the uh, this is not any other year. This is not like the previous years. In the mighty name of Jesus, if you are not receiving, I pray for myself. In the mighty name of Jesus. I deploy uh, Michael and his angels to fight every battle for me. Every battle that I say my health will not be intact. Every battle, every attack that has come against my health. And I don't know about you. Your word came that your marriage was going to be a kingdom marriage. And then your relationship was under attack. I decree in the name of Jesus, Michael and his angels are intervening for you. In the name of Jesus. A word came that you were a kingdom financial giant. And your finances went under attack. I give God permission. Ah. I deploy Michael and his angels to fight for you. Hey, whatever, whoever has held your finances, whoever, whatever has been swallowing your finances, I give Michael permission in the name of Jesus to hold them by the neck. They vomit it now in the name of Jesus. Every opportunity, every finance that has been taken, they vomit it out in the mighty name of Jesus. You are getting married. You are having that financial breakthrough that job where they re ah, they rejected you they will come looking for you they fired you they will call you with an apology and ah, 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 and 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 a payment in areas they treated you like child they will bow before you ah lizika barasi handa barusha laziana barasi handa barusha kaliana rasi and i hear the holy spirit telling me not only are you going to take what you deserve but god is about to redeem the times god is about to redeem the times god is about to redeem the times of someone god is about to redeem the times you know what that means? It means there is a restoration that is coming. That all the time that you have that has been lost, the time that you've lost, God is redeeming it in the name of Jesus. The time that you've lost, God is redeeming it in the name of Jesus. In other words, I'm saying the past two years that you've lost, God is giving it to you in two months. In two years, you are receiving everything you would have had in the past two years. Oh, la zika barasiana. In other words, I'm saying that what would have happened in the past seven years that you've been under attack, God is giving it to you in seven months. Ah, la zika barasiana. And I hear the Holy Spirit telling me a ten in one opportunity. A 10 in one opportunity. You have one opportunity that is worth 10 previous opportunities that you lost. In the mighty name of Jesus. I don't know who I'm talking to. But I know God sent me here for someone. They mess with the wrong person. But not this time. Not this year. It's not happening anymore. It's not happening anymore. You fought for so long. Now this battle is of the Lord. 
They tampered with your ministry. I don't know about yours, but they tampered with mine. But not anymore. Not this year. Not this year. This battle is not of me anymore. It's of the Lord. It's of the Lord. Angel Michael is taking charge. This battle is not of me. They tampered with my ministry, tampered with my health, but not this year. Not this year. They tampered with your marriage, but not anymore. Ha! Hey, they swallowed your children before they were born. Not this year. Not this year. I take it back. 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 I take back your finances. I take back your health. I take back your, 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 your marriage. I take it back. I take it back. I take it back in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Did you receive the word of God with gladness? If you did, just begin to thank God. And if you feel led to come, to connect to this world, just hit the, 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 the description box and you see the cash up and paypal there or you can simply just hit on that super thanks and the lord will bless you abundantly this is a season for sowing and planting this is a season for sowing and planting you can't afford to miss out on every opportunity for that in the name of jesus amen god bless you shalom